Okay, so I've laid out the cattle panels so I can start begin measuring and getting ready for my new trellis. I'm using eight six foot U posts. I'm gonna drive them each two feet into the ground. And then I'll use two 16 foot cattle panels to make this garden bed trellis. Now I'm going to install the first cattle panel. I've enlisted the help of my son to install these as they're a little bit awkward to do by yourself. Each of the U posts have these tabs used to hold the fencing in place and those kept getting hung up. So it was a little bit difficult trying to weave the U posts in and out of the panel spacing. In addition to trying not to step on my plants. If I could do this over again, of course, I would have done this before planting, but here we are. The finished dimensions are a little over six feet tall and just under eight feet wide across the base. I use string tied from post to post as a guideline to keep them straight and symmetrical. As a timeline, this is May 7th when I finished each trellis. Here we are May 19th, I added cedar picket borders. June 15th, you can see the vines growing up the trellis and working well. I have cantaloupe and honeydew in the left garden bed and watermelons in the right garden bed. Here you can see some of the honeydew and cantaloupes hanging from the trellis. August 5th, I'm spraying neem oil. You can see the watermelons growing on the right and the cantaloupe and honeydew on the left. This trellis worked out really well. I'm glad I did it. I hope you enjoyed this video and please subscribe.